Now, the most accurate weather team in Florida, ABC Action Weather. How you doing, everybody? Well, we're dodging some showers and storms. Clearly, the heaviest weather on Thursday was across our southern counties. Highlands County picked up some extremely heavy thunderstorms, a lot of rain, a lot of lightning. Most of us, though, just more clouds than sun and some occasional showers. Everything winds down overnight, waking up on Friday morning to partly cloudy skies, extremely warm and muggy and maybe an isolated shower or two along the coast. Rain chances only about 20% on Friday, and I still think the heaviest of them will be east of I-75. As we head into Saturday, same setup. Morning showers along the coast are possible. They're not likely possible. And then a better chance as we head inland later on in the day. I think those chances begin to bump up a bit by Sunday and into Monday. All in all, though, if you look at the long range five day forecast, notice by the time you roll into Monday, into Tuesday, those numbers bump up a bit as we get more of a southeast wind returning. And that is more common for our late day storms coming back toward the coast. And typically that's when we get our heaviest storms and also some of our better rainfall totals. So that's something a lot of folks have to look forward to later Monday, Tuesday and into the middle of the week. Here's Florida's most accurate seven day forecast, at least through Saturday. Rain chances only 20, maybe 30% up to 40% on Sunday. Heaviest in the eastern counties, but by Monday, Tuesday in the middle of next week, those winds come around and our rain chances return all the way back toward the beaches.